hello guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video as you can see by the title i will be talking about the netherlands yes i live in the netherlands and i have lived here for over 10 years now and i must say i have gained a lot of experience to be talking about this topic i'll be telling you 10 things that i like about the netherlands and maybe two or three things I don't like about the Netherlands. This video is for you if you are thinking of moving into the Netherlands. This video is for you if you are just curious about the Netherlands. So keep on watching and I will be telling you all. With that being said, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Are you done? Can we now continue? All right, let's continue. Point number one, the most important thing. If you are going to travel into any country, the first thing you should look out for is the health system. How is the health system? Without good health, we wouldn't be here. Without good health, I wouldn't be sitting here talking to you. The health system in the Netherlands is is the best compared to other countries. Everyone living in the Netherlands is required to have an insurance, at least the basic health insurance. Children under the 18 have access to free health insurance through their parents' insurance. So guys, if you have an, if you have an insurance, you are safe. You know, it's not that expensive and that makes it so good. When you go to the hospital or when you have to see your house doctor, you can see that things are well organized. If you have an appointment, it goes like it is planned, which is really good. And they have good doctors and good nurses. Well, I'm a nurse too, so I can tell you that, that they have a good nurses. All right, let's continue. Now, the second point, the people, the Dutch, how are they? Well, the Dutch, people are beautiful they are great people you know they are so open they are fun to work with but one thing you should know about the Dutch is they are very direct when it comes to dealing with people if a Dutch person wants to tell you something they just go ahead and tell you just as it is there is no mm, uh, um, they just tell you as it is so if you are coming from a country where people people talk indirectly you might you might have a problem with the Dutch in the beginning but once you once you live in the country you begin to adapt to it because that is the system that's what everybody does all right let's move to the next one the third one the the culture the Dutch have a very beautiful culture each year on the 27th of April, we have the King's Day, which is beautiful. It's the day that everybody is allowed to bring out their stuff in their house, to sell them for free, without paying any tax. On this day, you can find, you can find a lot of things at the lowest price. And sometimes you can end up having free stuffs because people just want to get rid of these stuffs in their house. So it's so fun. And the, the best part is after all the selling and buying, there is party. There is party, party after party. There is party. People just enjoy. It's a fun day. So if you are thinking of traveling to the Netherlands you might you must as well try to come here around this day to enjoy to have to experience it the Dutch also have this culture that they call the Zwarte Piet which is black pits and people I'm going to I'm going to insert a picture of how the Zwarte Piet or the black pit looks like so you can see it there are blacks who have problem with this culture. But you know, 
the Dutch, they, they will never change their culture for anybody. So me, I don't have a problem with it. That's their culture. If you put it in your mind that the, the culture is to bully you or the culture is, is to say something against you, then you will feel bad towards it. But once you clear your mind, be open about it, just live with it next one the fourth one the transportation system which is also so well organized yes to travel around here is so good it's so organized they have made it so easy for people if you want to go to a place with the bus it's so well organized like if they say the bus is coming at seven o'clock the bus will be there Yes, the bus will be there. It, hap it happens few times that the bus comes late, but that is not more than five minutes or ten minutes. So that's how good it is. And the train system is so good that you can travel across the country without any stress. Well, let's talk about biking. Wow, the Dutch, they love biking. If you're thinking of coming to the Netherlands and you don't know how to ride a bike, then you should start learning now. Because in Netherlands, people love riding the bike. The government has made it so safe for people to ride on the roadside because there is actually a bicycle way along the roadside, which is so good because you can ride safe. You feel it? That's Netherlands for you. Well, let's go to the fifth point, which is the school system. The school system is great. Children go to school for free until they are 18, which means every child, every child must go to school until they are 18. Yes, until you are 18, if you are living in the Netherlands, you are required to go to school. That is it. No one can change that. Based on your intelligence and based on your strength, they choose which level of education is good for you. So they have made it so easy that you, you wouldn't be in a class where you feel like you are, you are dumb or anything. There is a space for everybody to fit in. You get it? There is a space for everybody to fit in. That's it. That's how easy the Dutch has made it for us. Well, let's talk about the safety. How safe is Netherlands? How safe is Netherlands? Well, the Netherlands is a safe place to live. You know, you can go out at night without thinking about anyone attacking you or any harassment. You know, it's so safe. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say the place is 100% safe, but most of the time you can walk without feeling like someone is running after you or there is a ghost, you know, you feel so safe that you even forget that you're working alone. Let's go to the next one, work. How is the working system here? To find a work in the Netherlands is actually based on your education background. What you study will decide how fast you're going to get a job. Me, for instance, I am a nurse, which makes it for me so much easy to find a job anywhere that I live in the Netherlands, I can find a job. And even if I go across the country, I can also find a job. That's how it is for a nurse. That's one of the biggest advantage of being a nurse. But let's say you choose other sectors. Well, I don't know, but it could be difficult to find a job. The Dutch are not so quick in giving permanent contract. They mostly start with six months contract, um, eight months contract. You can even repeat it up to three times before they finally, they finally decide if they will give you a permanent contract or not. I think they do that because it's not easy to fire someone from, from their job also think so much about it before giving you a permanent contract with that being said let's go to the next one 
the accommodation how is the accommodation like in the Netherlands well I must say looking for an apartment or a house which is given by the government is not that easy but if you are going to rent through um, through a buyer or someone who owns the house it's easy but it's more expensive than getting a house from the government you know and i think the government has made has made it in such a way that people would rather buy a house than to rent i don't actually understand you could be on a waiting list for more than five years just to get a house from the government so that's how it is well i think actually i have said eight but i think i will stop here because the, the video is getting too long i am going to tell you about the bad side of netherlands the weather here is not great at all it's cold rainy and windy all that i just mentioned can happen in just a day even when you're sure it's not going to rain it does this is one of the reasons why the Dutch don't joke with their weather. Once they see a great weather, they appreciate it and they make very good use of it. The next point, let's talk about the language. The language, the Dutch. If you are coming from outside, coming into the Netherlands and you don't speak Dutch, who? If you are coming into the Netherlands, you should know that the Netherlands, the Dutch, they speak Dutch. If you want to make things easy for you, then you must learn the Dutch. You might feel like you are left out. So once you move to the Netherlands, try to learn at least a little bit. Let's talk about driving lances. Wow. Driving lances here is so hard to get and expensive i don't know why but i think you should go and ask them this is a question you should ask them it's so expensive and it's so hard to get i don't understand can somebody answer this for me thank you okay, these were the things i had and yes these were the points i wanted to share with you if you are planning on coming here please let me know and if you are coming here for school, that's great because this place is a great place to study. You should come here. If you are thinking of traveling here for vacation, that's also great. Amsterdam is a great place to come to. But try to also visit other places, not just Amsterdam. If you only stay in Amsterdam, you will miss a lot about other parts. So try to travel across the country when you come here. Well, I hope you've learned something from this video. Get to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Alright guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!